All right, Ruko Grant Plus. This is probably the banner lock of my lock picking career so far. It's considered very difficult. This is just, it's just a beautiful lock. All right. <laughs> Still open. Okay, don't break it. Don't break it. Okay, stay open. Careful with those victory laps. You've seen what happens. Oh boy. Ooh, ooh, ooh. High security shakes. <laughs> Either that or I've had too much coffee today. A little column A, a little column B. Speaking of which, little victory coffee tip here. Mmm. Oh, that's good stuff. All right. Okay. Shim, shimmy, shim, shimmy, shim, 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 brick. If you don't use a shim, you could get a brick. All right. Remember the shim song, everyone. Remember to shim your locks. Says the guy who doesn't always shim his locks. Okay. Easy does it. <laughs> Oh, I'm so glad this happened. I am excited, people. Yes. This is really an outstanding lock, and I have been I have been fighting it. I probably have more time in this than almost anything. I've been fighting this for pretty solidly for a couple of weeks now. A week? I don't know. I haven't had a lot of time. I guess I've been out of town and all kinds of stuff. So, yeah. All right, get it together, man. All right, we got a sidebar here. You see it's kind of, the fins are on the low side, the little web there. And they interact with, I don't know how well you can see that. Little tiny gates, I mean, little tiny gates on that guy. And they all have their false gates, but let's get these. He pins out first. this counter milling I think this is an older lock so it's a little worn but there's still definitely counter milling there oh, this is awesome okay I'm really excited about having picked this I know I should probably say that a lot but I get really excited about picking locks alrighty We'll get this guy slid out of there. Uh, a total of ten sliders. They're like these sort of ten half slider deals. Um, so you can see the little false gates in there. The little uh, serrations, I guess. They're not really false gates, maybe, but definitely serrations, which will fiddle with you while you're trying to pick the lock maybe maybe move this stuff up here and this has the uh, ass of barrel spool as well that's why I shut off the counter milling earlier ah, come on. okay Um, these are unsprung sliders, and they are hard to get in and out, I'll tell you what. <laughs> right. Come on, you. I don't want to start flinging sliders everywhere. I think this lock needs to be lubricated.
it's old and a little dirty so it mutes the feedback a little bit but makes uh, maybe everything a little less sharp so I guess there's some pros and some cons to having having it like this ten sliders six barrel spools of the evil asset style, style. Just attack, come at it from this way. Excited, excited. Whoa, there it is. <laughs> Sliders or finger pins, slider dingers. Uh, we already talked about the uh, counter milling. Now let's get these guys out. Oh, there it is. <laughs> I'm certainly glad this didn't turn into a one of my famous hour long picks. Concerned about that because this, I mean, for one thing, I was using a, a multi pick number 10 flag to pick this, and people generally discourage that, saying you don't have positive control over the slider nubs, and you know, you do end up picking them up and down with the number 10. But it's just not so bad. It fits in there really well. So, ah, biscuits. Come on. There it is. Here it is. Okay. Let's get a. There's nothing else special I don't think going on in there. There's the old sidebar groove. Whoop, whoop. Nothing. One of those Scandinavian cylinders. And there we have. What am I going to point with? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Slider thingers. One, two, three, four, five, six. Acid barrel spools. Although this one. I, I think this one was basically a zero lift. I don't remember doing much with that. Um, sidebar, and there it is. The uh, Asset, well, the Garant Plus slash Asset DP 4400, whatever. I think it's got a few different names. You'll see it in the title. Yeah, that's basically a, uh, nearly a zero lift. 
I, yeah, I think it has to be touched, but just brushing the pick past it does the job. Anyway, whew, there it is.